Hey Scribers, uh, in this video we're going to go over connecting photos and videos and illustrations to an inspection report and then saving them in the report and placing them in the report. Uh, so we've got a job that I've actually finished and it's open. Um, you can tell I've used most of the pictures because I've got the green check marks or the little hide mark. So I decided to not use that photo so I I hit it. Um, you can see up here show all media. I have that checked so it's showing all the images that I've used in the report. That's why they've got the green check marks. Now these came over on the mobile media. That's this guy right down here. Uh, so um, if I were to check out of that it's going to hide. I could click it. It's going to open up. We could go into some different folders here and we're going to see some of the illustrations that we ship with. Uh, that are available to use in the report. Um, but let's go back to this mobile media button. This is where all the images that synced over from my mobile app came in. And again, with the green check marks they're used, let's say you don't want to see those. You can uncheck show all media. And now I'm left with only a handful of pictures that I just decided not to use in this report uh, for various reasons, probably just duplicates or not a good picture. Um, so we could show all media or not. Um, now let's say you wanted to add some images to this. There's ways to do that. If you see the plus mark up here, you could open, you could click that, and that's going to open up a back door. Here you could see I could go into my pictures folder on my PC, and I could grab pictures. Or in this case, what I want to show you is I have an SD card that's from my infrared camera. So why don't we go and let's just grab? You can sort them by date, which is kind of nice. So we'll. Um, go up here and we'll grab this little group um, that I did most recently. Now I've added those to my mobile media folder so I can start dragging these in. Let me just show you dragging a few pictures in just so you can see what that's like. We could go under heating system. We could go under additional heat sources. Description, radiant floor, IR images included. And then I could just highlight a couple of these drag them in. Now a really cool feature of Scribeware is let's if you're working at home on a desktop and you have two screens you can actually drag images in from another screen. So I can't show you the other screen here but I've got a bunch of pictures up on a different screen and I'll just drag one in here. So you can drag them in from other screens which is really kind of convenient and easy. Now let's say you don't want to use a mobile app. You just want to take pictures old school with a camera. So then you might use this folder right here. So uh, this media folder is actually connected currently to a group of pictures. So let me show you how that works. I'm going to click change media folder and that's a back door into all my computer. So I can go to my pictures and all these are folders of different jobs that I've done. So uh, we could go to cold roof condensation. We'll see some cold roof condensation pictures and then we could start dragging these in and use them in the report if we needed. Uh, so I hope that makes sense. There's really just so many ways that you can connect photos and um, videos work exactly the same way. So you just drag them in and use them just like a photo. Uh, and then of course all your illustrations could also be dragged in uh, right here. And if you want to add more illustrations, you come up here and hit add media. And again, you could select a whole bunch of these using like the shift key and connect those to your folders if you needed to. So I hope this video helps. This is connecting photos, videos, and other media to your inspection report. Thanks for watching.